Welcome back. A competition coming up New Year's Eve right here on WPBF 25. Not with people, even better, with dogs. Over 5,000 dogs will compete to win the top title in the American Kennel Club's National Championship. Joining me now to talk about it all is co-host of the AKC National Championship and Executive Secretary Gina DiNardo and AKC's co-host and sportscaster Carolyn Mano. Thank you guys both so much for being here. First, can you tell us what's unique about the 2023 AKC National Championship? Yes. Hey, Taylor, thanks for having us. So it's the largest dog show in North America, which is what makes it unique. There are close to 6,000 dogs that start this competition. And then, of course, at the end, only one stands alone as national champion. But it's also a celebration of all the different breeds that are recognized by the American Kennel Club. You'll see whippets like Brooke and Mavis here. <laughs> but there are 200 different breeds. There's the AKC's newly recognized breeds as well. So it's a chance to learn a lot about some breeds that you know about and some that you might not be as familiar with. Yeah, and can you share anything with us about this year's winner? Well, I can tell you that it is one of the nation's top dogs, had been competing all year round and being at the top of the rankings and then became our national champion. I don't want to give away which group the dog's from because then you'll know when you're watching Best in Show who's going to win. But I can tell you that it's beautiful. It meets the breed standard. It gave an exceptional performance. Definitely deserves to have won. And what is on the line for these competitors? What's at stake? What are the rewards? Well, there's a $50,000 cash prize, Taylor, for the winner of the national championship. And there's even more than that that's doled out to all the competitors who make it really far in the competition. But more so than that, it's about bragging rights and etching your name into the history books of these national championships and these dog shows, which are so much a part of the fabric of American history. It's a life-changing event for the dog, for the owners, the breeders, the handlers that are involved. So it's a very special thing to hang your name in the rafters uh, after winning something like this. And I know you guys have some beautiful whippets on the couch there with you, but what breeds are most in the spotlight this year? So some of the rarer breeds that you don't see every day walking down Main Street or even at all dog shows, we have all 200 breeds represented. So you'll see things like the Spinoni Italiano, the Bracco Italiano, our 200th breed, a Sussex Spaniel, Sholo Eats Queenly, rare breeds that would make great family pets, but you just might not know about. And so that's what really is special about watching the national championship. You can learn about all the different breeds and find one that you may not know about but then whoa that'll just be fitting perfectly in with my family if i could just get one so yeah. <laughs> all right sounds like a great event gina and carolyn thank you both for joining us here this morning if you want more information about the akc competition head over to our website wpbf.com and you can watch the akc national championship right here on wpbf 25 again airing new year's eve that is sunday afternoon at two